thinking about scrapping the cherry and going to Walmart. Keep the live edge on it. That's what I'm going to do. God, I'm going to have to cut all these by hand. Horse shit. I'm going to have to do these in two glue-ups. So first I'll get these corners secured, then I'll do the other corners, and then I'll add some kind of um, structural support on the backside. All right, moving back to this picture frame. So I, got, I had a piece of glass lying around, so I can use that. I've already kind of spaced it all out, five by seven. Uh, that's gonna be the back side. I'm gonna take this, I rip this board down to three eighths, I wanna say. And that's gonna sit around the outside. And then I'm gonna take this and I'm also gonna rip it down some more for the, the backer, the glass and the other thing, and the picture. And add that, and I'm gonna, so I'm gonna go down a little bit, and then I'm gonna add little tabs that go over and lock it in this. this it's basically gonna be two frames, one frame on the outside and then another frame that goes inside that holds everything and then these little clips that go around and hold it together. So I'm just gonna work on building the frame around it right now. Uh, I don't have to do too much, nothing crazy in terms of like uh, joints or anything like that because it's just gonna lay there and it'll be fine. So I'll start by setting up the, the one side so I can make adjustments on the other side if I need to to make it fit properly. But right now I'm just getting 
I had it marked out. So now I have that on the line. So I'll just set that up for that one side. Wait, you know, a couple minutes for that to harden up. And then I'll put this glass in and add the other side. So my bad. I meant to record this, but it was just a bunch of like me just knocking stuff out. I was just using my my scribing knife and my quarter inch chisel. And I'm just making a little bit of a picture frame here. So all these pieces will go together and go into here. These will go together once I get that in there. And then that'll be a frame within the frame. And then I just need to do little latches that flip over and this will provide the backing to hold that everything in. And I gotta figure out um, how to make this stand up. So I got this leftover piece of cherry from when I was cutting down some stuff. And I think it'd be, I'm just gonna take that, kind of marked out and drill the hole and uh, I'm just going to cut the down and kind of knock off some pieces. And then those pieces will get attached to these corners here. And they'll just swing around and hold the little frame in. So let's get this stuff out of here. Classy. And I use cardboard from... from uh, white claw boxes but you know you'll have the glass Put that shit. you know the glass you know the backer and some cardboard just to beef it up a little bit and that slides in there so you put your picture in there we'll slide you know put that frame in the back those things will swivel over and then that will hold that in place These done, I'm just gonna put them on the sandpaper, clean them up a little bit. Really should be put in a drill and blah blah blah, but. I'll just do it by hand, they just fall off. Just want to give a little place for the head of the nail because I have these for little brass nails that I'm going to put through and I'll sit down a little bit and that will have to swivel around. Go, go, turn this in. Boom, boom, boom. We got a little picture frame that holds holds stuff. That's pretty nice, huh? So again, back making gonna make a little V. I already have some pieces left over from cutting this up, and I just kind of. I have to cut them down to size with what I had left. And then we're just going to sit over each other in the back. Uh, however, I have it set up. Oh, yeah, sorry, this way. I have, uh, I already drew the angles on there. And I'm just going to cut 
half laths in there just so uh, they can joint together. And my marking knife is around here somewhere. There she is. Well, let's get to it, too. All right, continuing with this. Got it all together. Got the back on it. And now it just sits on there. Beautiful. So, um, still gonna add, I think, a little something there just to just 
strengthen it. And then what I'm going to do here is I think I'm going to square up the fronts here. I already marked that out. I'm going to round up the corners, just, just to round it up and to slice and cut them down just a hair. And then sand it all up and glue it all up and put it all together. And we're done. So get on that. <clears throat> Alrighty, here's the beautiful part. We go from bare and naked. I'm gonna put some boiled linseed oil on this and just watch the color come out. 